A groundbreaking discovery has been made by researchers who have successfully developed a novel category of materials known as glassy gels. Greetings everyone! Today we will be delving into the fascinating realm of glassy gels, a groundbreaking class of materials developed by researchers. These innovative substances combine the remarkable characteristics of both glassy polymers and gels. Similar to glassy polymers, glassy gels possess exceptional hardness, yet they possess an extraordinary ability to stretch up to five times their original length without experiencing any fractures. Moreover, these materials exhibit remarkable adhesive properties and serve as efficient conductors of electricity. By blending liquid precursors of glassy polymers with an ionic liquid, the production of glassy gels becomes a simple and straightforward process offering immense potential for a wide range of practical applications. So, without any further delay, let us embark on our exploration of this captivating subject. Throughout history, gels and glassy polymers have been considered separate categories of materials. Glassy polymers, known for their rigidity and fragility, are commonly utilized in the production of items like water bottles and airplane windows. On the other hand, gels, exemplified by contact lenses, possess a liquid component and exhibit a soft and pliable nature. According to Michael Dickey, the Camille and Henry Dreyfus Professor of Chemical and Biomolecular Engineering at North Carolina State University, a new category of materials called glassy gels has been developed. These materials possess the same level of hardness as glassy polymers, but have the unique ability to stretch up to five times their original length without breaking under sufficient force. Furthermore, when these materials are stretched, they can revert back to their original shape when heat is applied. Additionally, the glassy gels have a remarkably adhesive surface, which is not commonly found in rigid materials. According to Mei Xiang Wang, a postdoctoral researcher at NC State and co-lead author of the paper, glassy gels stand out due to their ability to conduct electricity more efficiently than common plastics with similar physical properties, primarily because they contain over 50% liquid content. Wang expresses optimism regarding the potential usefulness of these materials, given their numerous distinctive properties. Glassy gels, as their name implies, are a remarkable substance that merges the appealing characteristics of both glassy polymers and gels. The process of creating these gels involves combining the liquid precursors of glassy polymers with an ionic liquid. This concoction is then poured into a mold and subjected to ultraviolet light, which solidifies the material. Once the mold is taken away, what remains is the glassy gel. According to Dickey, the ionic liquid functions as a solvent composed entirely of ions, resembling water in this regard. When a solvent is introduced to a polymer, it typically causes the polymer chains to separate, resulting in a soft and pliable material. This is why a wet contact lens can be easily manipulated, while a dry one cannot. In the case of glassy gels, the solvent causes the molecular chains within the polymer to disperse, granting it the ability to stretch like a gel. However, the presence of ions in the solvent creates a strong attraction to the polymer, preventing the chains from moving freely. This lack of mobility is what gives the material its glassy nature. Consequently, the material possesses a rigid quality due to these attractive forces, but still retains the capability to stretch owing to the increased spacing between the chains. In their research, the scientists discovered that a range of polymers and ionic liquids could be utilized to produce glassy gels, although certain types of polymers are not suitable for creating such gels. According to Dickey, polymers with a charged or polar nature show potential in the creation of glassy gels due to their attraction to the ionic liquid. During the testing phase, the researchers made an interesting discovery. The glassy gels, despite being composed of 50 to 60% liquid, do not evaporate or dry out. Dickey notes that the most captivating attribute of the glassy gels is their remarkable adhesiveness. Although we have a solid grasp on their hardness and ability to stretch, the exact factors that contribute to their stickiness remain a matter of speculation. The ease of manufacturing glassy gels has led the researchers to believe that they have great potential for practical applications. According to Dickey, the process of producing glassy gels is straightforward, 
and can be accomplished by either curing it in any mould or utilising 3D printing. In contrast, other plastics with comparable mechanical characteristics necessitate a more complex procedure. Manufacturers must first create the polymer as a feedstock and then transport it to a separate facility where it is melted and shaped into the final product. We eagerly anticipate exploring the potential applications of glassy gels and are enthusiastic about collaborating with partners to identify innovative uses for these materials. On June 19th, the esteemed journal Nature will publish a groundbreaking paper titled Glassy Gels Toughened by Solvent. Xun Xiao, hailing from the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill, takes on the role of co-lead author for this remarkable study. The esteemed list of co-authors includes Salma Siddika, a dedicated PhD student at NC State, Mohammed Shamsi, a former PhD student at NC State, Ethan Frey, an accomplished undergraduate student at NC State, Brendan O'Connor, a distinguished professor of mechanical and aerospace engineering at NC State, Wu Bin Bai, a renowned professor of applied physical sciences at UNC, and Wen Chan, a respected research associate professor of mechanical and materials engineering at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln. Funding from the Coastal Studies Institute played a significant role in supporting the work. To support our channel's growth and ensure broader awareness, kindly hit the like and subscribe buttons. This will help us reach more individuals and disseminate valuable information. Thank you in advance.